Jeff Chandler for the events calendar. Event tickets comes with a number of template files that determine how the plugin looks and behaves. We call these templates views because they create the pages and elements that you see on your site. Each plugin and add-on has its own unique set of templates and each template can be copied and customized in your theme folder. It's important that you don't edit the view files directly in the plugin. Instead, we recommend overwriting the files in your theme, which is covered in a knowledge base article, which will be linked to below in the video description entitled Customizing Template Files. And you can also see that article on your screen right now. In fact, there's even a YouTube video you could search for on the, the events calendar YouTube channel, search for template overrides. Now we've put together a detailed list of all the available templates that come included with tickets email so that you can customize them to your liking. But I want to show you something. As mentioned previously, if you're using event tickets 5.6.0 or above, you'll be able to use the new version of email templates. For visual reference, here's what the ticket email template looks like. As you can see on your screen, I've browsed to event tickets, source, views, emails, and this is the ticket.php template. So pretty much the code version of what we're going to see in the next portion of the video. But here you see in this template, we have the header, we have the body, and we have the footer. But what does it look like in event tickets 5.6.0 and above? Well, it looks sort of like this. Now, once tickets emails is enabled, this is going to override existing template changes. And from here, you'll be able to edit the subject of the email, the heading, you can add additional content. There's also options to add the calendar links, calendar invites, etc. And if you go back to the main page here, we'll check out, we'll go back to emails. And if we scroll down, you'll see this is where the footer content is. So you'll also be able to customize the footer content, select different display options for branding for your tickets, etc. And if we go back into the ticket email, you'll see the site title and attendee name here. These are placeholders. And we have a detailed list of all of the available placeholders that you can use that we'll link to in a knowledge base article in the video description below. For these specific email templates, Event Tickets provides a no-code solution that suits most use cases. If you run into any issues with customizing your tickets emails, please contact our support team.